My name is Dave Patterson. I'm the Regional Director for Canadian Blood Services. I look after the recruitment uh, of blood stem cell donors in British Columbia and all our collection centers right across British Columbia. Uh, Canadian Blood Services, we refer to ourselves as Canada's lifeline, and that's really what we are. Whether we're supplying blood to patients in hospitals, whether we're recruiting stem cell donors to possibly Find that one person who could be the perfect match, maybe the only match that a patient needs to survive. Uh, we support uh, BC Transplant in their goal of bringing more folks to uh, the transplant registry. And we also work with organs and tissues as well. So, uh, and, and of course, our newest venture in plasma. We're opening plasma centers across the country. So when we talk about ourselves as Canada's lifeline, we think of all those products and how we help patients. Well, our mission, our, our vision really, is to help every patient match every need and help every Canadian. So we can manufacture human, human blood. So the only way we can support patients' human blood is through collecting it from volunteer donors. Um, and so that's, that's the biggest part of the work that we do here. So I like giving back to the community and I started giving blood last year at a fund. Yeah. And since then, I feel like this is everyone's responsibility to give back to the community. So this is the way I found it more, you know, more good to give to the community. So I started since and every two months I donate blood. Volunteers are really important to the Canadian Blood Services because if you think of all the work that we do, it relies on volunteers. Whether you're a volunteer blood donor, a volunteer stem cell registrant, uh, a volunteer who is registering at um, BC Transplant to be a, a life-giving donor, you know. So there's that aspect of volunteerism at Canadian Blood Services. And then there's the other type of work that volunteers do for us here and right across the country. So they may be helping us take care of our donors after they donate. Um, you would see the smiling face of someone making sure that you're hydrated and refreshed and you have a snack before you go back to your everyday work. We think of volunteers in a different way. The way we approach volunteerism is do what you can do to support Canada's lifeline. And that could be chairing a table in the lunchroom at your place of work. It could be outside of work. You're a member of a book club or you need a swimming club or you're the chairman of your local rotary club. All those places are great opportunities for you to be a, a volunteer for Creative Blood Services because you could advocate for people to donate. In Canada, one in two people is eligible to donate, but one in 81 actually does. Now, the only way that we can help patients is through recruiting donors. I'm at the Canada Blood Service, Surrey, and I'm here to donate blood. Can we come with you? Yeah, sure. Perfect, come let's on. go. Awesome. So Canada Blood Services will send you a questionnaire, which you can do online or on your phone. So I have already done that. I've entered in, I scanned my QR code, and then uh, uh, they told me that, uh, told me about my appointment, I pressed OK, yes, that I'm here, and after that, I booked another appointment for uh, after two months in advance, so that I don't have to do it later on, and it will send an email to me right away. Yes, it's very easy. It will hardly take 10 minutes. If somebody watching this today wants to volunteer with us, it's very simple. Uh, send an email into blood.ca, call our toll free number at 1 888 2 donate, and they'll get your information to the, to the right person.